Everyone makes mistakes from time to time and Sage Accounts makes it very easy to correct this. If you've entered a transaction in error you can delete it or if you've just made a simple mistake such as forgetting to change the dates or posting it to the wrong nominal code you can easily amend it using the edit option. Let's have a look at how you do that in the software. We're already in the transactions list and we've got a transaction here that we're going to use for our example transaction 1297 which is a purchase invoice and what we're going to do we're just going to edit it and amend the date so we've posted it on the 27th of November we'll say that should have been on the 26th so we highlight the transaction and then at the top we click edit and we can just go in amend the date click save click yes to the prompt do you wish to post these changes and that's it done the transaction is now dated the 26th now what happens when you edit a transaction depends on what field you edit so some of the fields are classed as what's called critical and some are classed as what's termed non-critical now if you just amend a non-critical field such as a reference number or the details of the transaction then it will just update the original transaction 1297 and nothing else happens if you amend a critical field such as an account reference date nominal code or a value then what the transaction will do it will update the original transaction but also if we just scroll down we'll see it's also posted an additional transaction to the end and that will see a deleted C transaction 1297 which refers to the transaction that we amended so the deleted transaction will be a copy of what was originally entered so you can see the date there 27th of November that's what we originally entered now if you need to amend the value or nominal code of a transaction we'll just concentrate on this one again it's 1297 click edit at the top and then we need to go to this section here this item line details section so if you've got an invoice for instance that might have a number of items on it you would find the item highlight it click edit and then you can amend things like the nominal code you've got the details in there the department if you use projects you can amend that details as well as the values as well once you've made your amends click close you would then click save and confirm that you want to make those changes other than that that's how easy it is to edit your transactions